Liberal MP took too long with ethics disclosure. Ought to apologize in commons. Dion by the Canadian Press. So here we have, out of Ottawa, the federal ethics watchdog, Mayor Dion, said Thursday in a Liberal MP broke the rules when he took far too long to comply with the Conflict of Interest Code. Now, Toronto Area MP James Maloney is being told to apologize to the House of Commons for the breach. All MPs must disclose to the Ethics Commissioner their private interests and those of their family members within 60 days of being elected. Ethics Commissioner Mario Dion says Maloney took months and only formally completed the process after he was contacted by a journalist in August. So a journey. Maloney told Dion that the delay was partially due to a misunderstanding of what information was needed, but also that the demands of COVID-19 pandemic kept him too busy. Mm Mm-hmm. We believe that, right? Leave your comments below. Dion said his office allowed some flexibility for the pandemic, you know and has also granted Maloney an extension. But he still took too long to submit the information. Dion's office says requiring that Maloney apologize a final determination on what would be up to the House of Commons itself marks the first time a sanction has been levied for a member failing to imply, comply with the code. Quote, Having considered Mr. Maloney's disregard for the post-election obligations under the code, I recommend that the House require Mr. Maloney to apologize to it for having failed to fulfill his obligations as a member in the context of this initial compliance process under the code, Dion said in his report, released Thursday today. In his own statement posted to social media, Maloney said he does not intend to apologize in the comments and also... He also apologized online. So he's you know he's going to do it in the comments. So we'll, uh, stay tuned for that. We'll have it for sure. He said, while well, his career as a lawyer and MP, he has always taken his ethical obligations seriously and accepts the commissioner's finding. Quote, it is not my intention to withhold any information, he said. The report is by Canadian Press. It was first published on 19 November 2020. Stephanie Levitz wrote this article working for the Canadian Press. Well, um, we're going to go through uh, in December. Um, stay tuned for our uh, ethics violations. We're, we're, the, the House of Commons is down for five weeks, so we're going to be um, giving everyone the ethics. Leave your comments below. Like, subscribe. Have a good day. Have a good day.